Thanks for watching another video log about Yamaha, CL and QL consoles. We've recently introduced version 5.1, which includes remote control functions for additional useful devices. These consoles are already the most versatile and advanced in the world in terms of system control, and we've broadened their scope even further. Now, we can integrate with not only Shure and Sennheiser wireless mic systems, but also Sony with the DWR R03D digital wireless receivers, popular with broadcasters and theatres. Then we have the StageTech Nexus XDIP multi-channel I.O. board. This allows remote control of up to 64 mic preamps. Nexus is used as an audio routing system in many theatres and performing arts centres around the world. On the output side, we have Nexo's NX Amp Mark II 4x1 and 4x2 powered controllers. These are used with pretty much the full range of Nexo's line array and point source systems. They're increasingly seen in sports stadiums and concert halls as well as used for music tours and other live sound events. And then we have Yamaha's own DZRD powered loudspeakers with Dante. Ideal for smaller corporate events, worship venues and music shows, they bring the audio network right to the speaker for simplified connections and system management. There are 10, 12 and 15 inch cabinets as well as 15 and 18 inch extended low frequency subs in the range. And finally, the Yamaha MRX7D and MTX5D matrix processors, which provide pre-programmed processing and mixing for ballrooms, conference centers, and other multi-purpose venues. And they include eight mic preamps, which can be remote controlled from the mixer. Now, there's beauty in simplicity. And here, each device needs just one network cable to carry both Dante audio and the control signals. Just connect each Dante primary port to the same network switch. Then make sure each device is using the same IP address range for its control communication. They all support auto mode or DHCP, so very little setup is required. Only remember to set a Y0 ID number for each device before establishing a connection with the QL or CL mixer. Let's take a look at the controls on offer. The Sony system provides us with a transmitter attenuator and name, receiver mute, quality signal, RF level and battery status. And after you've made a patch for the Dante input, you can see these functions in the channel view. The Nexus XDIP provides 64 channels with input gain, fandom power and high pass filter. And again, these controls follow the Dante patch to the input channels. Bear in mind that additional software is required on the Nexus side to allow this control to operate. So please contact the StageTech team for details. Regarding Yamaha's MRX7D and MTX5D, their eight inputs can be controlled from the I.O. device page or from the input channel views, so long as you patch their Dante inputs one to eight. And now the Nexo NX Amp. We can see this in the Amp tab of the I.O. device menu. And here we are able to monitor all the status indicators and input meters, as well as voltage and protect levels for all four channels and we have control of the output volumes and mutes. In addition, we have a mute all control and amp standby button. Finally, the Yamaha DZRD devices. Each powered speaker will show its preset, version and status information with its input level meters. Remember, they can mix analog inputs with Dante digital inputs. Then the mixer provides controls for the high pass filter, EQ on off, delay time, master level control and mute button. 
Remember, up to 24 external devices can be controlled from one mixer at the same time. It allows one engineer to operate and monitor quite a large system with confidence and efficiency. It's going to save you a lot of time, energy and hassle and bring simplicity to otherwise quite complex technical arrangements. Find all the related files and downloads in the professional audio pages at yamaha.com.